Hello, this is Keonix. This is just going to be a quick tutorial on how to set up Roblox on the Steam Deck, at least as of the time I'm recording this, which is the 8th of August 2024. Now, a couple things to keep in mind. One, I am not an expert on the Steam Deck by any means, so if I end up getting anything wrong, um, let me know in the comments. And two, uh, this guide could break at any moment. Uh, Roblox has notoriously blocked stuff like wine from working, so instead we'll be using a much different method. First thing you want to do is you want to head into desktop mode. Once you're in desktop mode, you just want to go to your browser of choice, in which case I'm using Firefox. You want to search for vinegar. HQ. You'll be taken to the Vinegar website. This is what you used to use to get Roblox on Linux slash Steam Deck, but now, notice you can now play Roblox with Sober. If you click on that, we will be taken to this website, sober.vinegarhq.org. And it's basically an unofficial port of the Roblox app for mobile to Linux. And installing it is pretty simple. So, and today is you want to click on Get Flatpak. Go download this file, sober.flatpakref, or double click. It'll probably prompt you to open Discover. Here it is. Go to sober, hosted at sober.vinegar.org. Click install. It'll ask you for your password if you have one, so go ahead and do that. You'll probably get an error like this, but that's fine. You just close that, cancel, then install again. And there we go. Sometimes the install button will still be there. If you click it, though, it'll tell you. Yeah, it's already installed. Right then, so, if you go into Home Menu Games, you should see Sober here. You want to launch that. Continue. This is where it majorly differs from something like Vinegar or Grape Juice. The Roblox APK file. So, where do you get this? Well, what I recommend is going to searching. Roblox APK Mirror I do highly recommend getting a, um, an ad block for your browser if you haven't already just in case scroll to available downloads you want to use your latest version I want this one APK bundle, that's fine. And it should download it. That's done, you want to just extract it to a subfolder, no matter the silver. I'm going to go to select application bundle, go to whether you extracted your zip folder. And you just want to drag all of this here. Make sure you get all of the APKs. It doesn't matter if the other files are selected or not. Hit open. Sober has finished setting up, and now, Roblox. I'm gonna go ahead and quickly sign in with my account, and there we go. Roblox is officially installed. So now if I, for example, try to play a game like Pressure, there we go. As you can see, it runs pretty damn decently. Now, there is one major caveat, and it might be a deal breaker for some of you. You won't be able to use this properly in gaming mode, meaning that adding it to Steam and having it show up in the main menu. Uh, I did try just to like see what it looked, see what it was like, but unfortunately, a lot of stuff gets broken. For example, the resolution is much smaller, controls are all messed up. Like, you have to set them all manually, and even then stuff like the scroll reel doesn't work. Overall, it's not the greatest. And obviously, this also means you won't be able to take full advantage of stuff like the back buttons or gyro if you're into that sort of thing. This is much more limited than something like vinegar or grape juice. Yeah, other than those issues that I mentioned earlier, um, it runs great. Surprisingly, like even in a game like as visually impressive as uh, Nico's next bots, like it still looks pretty damn good. But uh, yeah, if you found this video helpful, uh, like and comment. I probably won't ask you to subscribe because you know 
I don't make tutorials like this often. I do stream sometimes and I have memberships available if you want to support the channel in a more direct way and gain some cool perks. I also have a Discord server, links in the description. And with that, I shall see you all next time. Bye for now. Special thank you to Twitchy Camera, Mango's Artistic Corner, JadenRod123, JoshiGod211, Applemos, and I am Tired7846 for becoming Black Mages. I appreciate all of your support.